Hi, this is Jim Lyon, the host of the All That To Say podcast. Before you dive in today, be sure and subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you can catch all of our fearless conversations. I was just in a conversation um, with a group of scholars from all different areas, um, from the sciences, from the the, uh, psychology. uh, People were um, writers, humanists, and they were reflecting um, on the fact and, and uh, some of these uh, scholars were from really ex- extraordinary secular universities, Princeton, uh, Stanford. And they said the student of today just does not have any comprehension that there is, in fact, an objective truth. Mm-hmm. And this caused real difficulties in ethics classes. Because if we as human beings, as a society, as a world, we need to be able to think deeply about about the ethics, think just about euthanasia, think about uh, artificial intelligence, uh, think about um, the CRISPR of the human uh, genome. All of these things just pose such huge ethical questions. If there is no standard, if there is no objective truth, that there, there are boundaries that must be observed because of objective truth, uh, our world is in trouble. And so Christian colleges and universities, by acknowledging that there is, in fact, objective truth, one of the most important places to find that objective truth is in the Holy Scriptures. And what a joy that is to be able to have that text where you can find objective truth. And what a joy it is then to share that. So we started this conversation about the fact that um, maybe a, a student comes to a Christian college who is not yet a Christian, but the opportunity to present those those um, winsome truths to somebody and then have their life change forever and then their family's life change forever and maybe generations change forever uh, because that it is so appealing actually uh, to be able to center in a God of the universe who has set up the objective truth to how we are to live as human beings.